Rock a bye, baby, on the treetop. Your mother slid her wrists in the bathtub. Hello everyone and welcome to Heavy Rain. Literally picking up where I left off last time. Let's get straight back into it. He doesn't act on impulse, but plans his crimes in a very meticulous fashion. <laughs> and where does all that get us? <laughs> Just gonna keep flicking through the slides. Aggressive! It builds up a profile of the killer and helps us understand the person we're looking for. Boop. It might have been useful if it was done earlier in this investigation. All the victims Beep. are drowned in rainwater. Boop. The killer kills only in the fall when there is plenty of rain. It could be that he puts them in some sort of well or tank that is open to like, the skies and that fills when up there's the heavy rain. The more it rains, <laughs> could you stop the flicking the less slides? Time the victim has to live. I was able to isolate a zone where the killer might live. Cool. And, and what size is this uh, zone? For the moment, about ten square miles. Hmm. Oh, great. There must be 10,000 people living in that sort of area. You gonna question them one by one? Yes. Let's flip-flop. Let's do calm. The more clues we get, the more we can reduce the zone. We can then cross-check it with our list of oh, suspects. Oh god, his mouth looks awful. So what's next? There are two so suspects what's whose psychological next? profile might- The killer's out there somewhere, we gotta get off our asses and find him. How much time do we have left? Why are you just smiling? Why do people keep smiling in horrible situations? Hours. Oh. Oh well. I'm pretty sure that kid's gonna die. If I have anything to say about it. <laughs> Alright, me and Blake, best friends forever. Let's go. Oh, that close up. No answer. We waste our time coming here. Eh, yeah, shoot the door open. Maybe we should have a little look inside anyway. There's nobody home. I'm talking about breaking the law. There is now. See? I'm not sure that's entirely legal. You're not sure? Call the cops. You're not sure. You're you're FBI. And you're not sure it's legal. Hmm. I get that, that was supposed to be coy, but there was no like He didn't put anything into it. He just like I'm not sure that's entirely legal. Looks like Nathaniel Williams like, is a pretty I'm not sure guy. that's entirely legal. That would have been... He's a God-fearing idiot uh, whatever. waiting for the end of the world. If I analyze every weird line read, we him a few I'm gonna be at this forever. Well, this ain't our guy. He's just religious. Don't know why everybody seems to think candles have something to do with religion. Uh, God said, thou shalt light a candle in thy an thine honor. I don't remember that being in the Bible. Candles are still lit. He should be back soon. Oh, there you go. He's back. Hello, buddy. We broke into your house. Now we're looking at your stuff. Hashtag prayer for Jesus. I'm Agent Norman Jaden, FBI. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Norman Jaden, FBI. As God is my witness, I haven't done anything. I believe I'm him. innocent. Oh, we both know who talks to you. What does he say to you, Nathaniel? Intervene. Blake, what are you doing? I can't talk about it. You mustn't talk about it. Get between them. He That's orders enough. you to go and Leave find him prey, alone. Doesn't he? <laughs> He's just he ignoring me. More and more. Why is this guy such a jerk? Stop. Stop. Leave him alone. That's enough. You took that boy with you and you drowned him. Isn't that right? He's just desperate to get anyone, isn't no. he? As his killer. Stop. Stop. You killed them, didn't you, Nathaniel? Punch him. Confess, you bastard. Punch the cop. You are the Antichrist. Put down the gun, I Nathaniel. Punch. <laughs> that escalated quickly. He is the son of Satan. He was sent to Earth to destroy us. For Christ's sake, shoot! No! Lieutenant Blake is going to leave our planet <laughs> right now and return to the what? realm of shadows. Creature of darkness, I can beseech you to return to the realm of shadows and leave our Nathaniel in peace. He just slid Jane, back into place, you see that? You shall regret confronting the emissary of the Lord. You shall know divine power. Kill Blake. Kill, 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 kill Blake. Protect oh, you're going to die, Blake. Good lad. There we go. We de-escalated the situation. I, I kind of wanted to shoot him, but at the same time, it's better Put your hands on your head. to do it this way, because there was a small chance that I could have got Blake killed, maybe. Motherfucker! <laughs> In the name of the Lord, Dang. I exorcise thee, Satan. I'm so glad okay, I didn't free. shoot him. The show's over. You're under arrest. <laughs> but I wish he had a knife or something to just stab Blake. And off we go. <laughs> Hello. Oh, there's a baby there. So far, Shelby's been pretty useless. Hmm. Seems his shoulders healed pretty quick. Oh, there we go. 
Hello? <laughs> Why is there a musical sting there? The music is so all over the place in this game. Nah, I'm just gonna walk into her house without saying anything. What's this? Oh, Jesus. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, what? Please take care of my baby. Is she dead? Hello? Ooh, what's behind door number three? Mrs. Bowles! Mrs. Bowles, are you there? <laughs> oh! Good thing I wasn't injured recently when it comes to fight. <sighs> Otherwise, this would be really painful! Ah, uh, she killed herself. Eh, just watch her bleed out. Just gonna... Strangle you. Mrs. Bowles! Mrs. Bowles, can you hear me? Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! <laughs> what do I do? Oh god! <laughs> um... I'll get you a towel. Let's put it back in the tub. <laughs> Of your armpit. Up oh, again. There you are, you're fine. Alright, let's put you on the bed. I'm gonna call an ambulance. No, I I don't want to go to the hospital, please. Okay. Okay. You got something around here I can dress this one with? Yeah. I think so. Okay. Don't move. I'll be right back. Oh, she gave up on suicide pretty quick. I need this. And this. And this. Taking your stuff. Bye. Oh, I can't. <laughs> this is such a creepy shot. <laughs> this. There you go, yeah. Egypt. Stay. Alright. Um. Alright, does that mean he's gonna leave her to die? Or stay means he's gonna stay with her? I'm just gonna say alright. I'm here for you, Susan. All right. You'll be all right. I'll take care of you. Da, 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 da. Dr. Shelby in the house. Bandit. Fixes uh, slip wrists every time. There, I done what I can. That should stop the bleeding. Well, luckily the wounds aren't too deep. How are you feeling? You okay? Fantastic. Just tried to kill myself. My baby. My baby needs me. You weren't thinking about that a few minutes ago. Right. You stay there. Ah, uh, babysitter okay. Shelby in the house now. Do you even know who I am? You know what to do? With a baby, I mean. More than you. I'm a private eye. There's nothing I can't do. <laughs> Her name is Emily. <laughs> Hi there, Emily. So, what seems to be the problem, huh? Oh! Going by the smell? I got a pretty good idea. Oh, this will be a fun scene. Changing the baby's diaper. Okay. How do you do this again? Hmm? Again? Have you done this before? There you go. Fresh new baby. Now throw it out the window. Hey, what's the matter? I'm hungry. I thought we solved the problem. No, there's a full bottle of milk, which means I gotta do that. Fun, exciting gameplay. This is my life. This is what I'm doing. Feeding virtual babies. I'll just tilt this ball a little bit so you don't choke. <laughs> a little bit? That's not a little. <laughs> Fucking choking. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Couldn't resist. Alright, well, not fail it because I don't want to constantly keep doing this. Pat, pat, pat. <laughs> pat, pat, pat. Go on, puke on him. Puke oh, to him. Good job, Emily. Hmm? Nope. You're feeling good now, right? rock a bye baby, on the treetop. Your mother slid her wrists in the bathtub. I messed that prompt up, just gonna... <laughs> oh. Sorry, oh, I didn't You're mean this. Oh, right? God. <laughs> I was freaking out. Thanks for looking after my baby. You're welcome. I didn't want to leave her. I just couldn't cope anymore. Do you take care of this baby on your own? <laughs> that Doesn't face. Jeremy's father live with you anymore? He disappeared. The day after Jeremy. Oh. I don't know what happened to him. I do. 
Maybe. No, it went to do those Maybe little test things and died or whatever. Ever since I've had to look after Emily all on my own, and he left the house without a word, and there was just the cell phone. Cell phone? A cell phone? Yeah, I, I found a cell phone <laughs> in his dresser. You can have it if you'd like. I'm sure it's of more use to you than to me. Yoink! I am out of here! Thank goodness. That was awkward. I'm sure she'll be fine. Probably. Alright guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. Thanks very much for watching, and as always, I'll see all you beautiful people in the next video. We're going to torture the heck out of Ethan. Bye-bye!